On October 17, 2024, the German Navy Corvette Ludwigshafen am Rhein, part of the United Nations Interim Force in Lebanon Unifil, successfully intercepted and neutralized an approaching drone near the Lebanese coast. The incident occurred at approximately 7 a.m. local time amidst escalating tensions in the region, underscoring the growing threats faced by peacekeeping forces. The unmanned aerial vehicle UAV, which posed an immediate threat, was brought down using a defensive system, ensuring it crashed in a controlled manner off the northwest coast of Nakura. The Bundeswehr's Operations Command confirmed the event, noting that some of the drone's debris had been recovered for further investigation, though most of it was destroyed near the vessel. This marks the first recorded drone-related incident involving the Ludwigshafen am Rhein in recent times, highlighting the increasing use of drones in the region's conflicts. The interception comes at a time when UNIFIL forces have faced repeated attacks. Some reports attribute these incidents to Israeli troops, while others suggest clashes between Hezbollah and Israeli forces. Regardless, the mandate of UNIFIL remains critical, to monitor the ceasefire, support Lebanon's government in securing its maritime borders, and prevent arms smuggling by sea. In the past week alone, UNIFIL forces have been targeted multiple times, further exacerbating concerns about the safety of peacekeepers in southern Lebanon. The German contribution to the UNIFIL Maritime Task Force is substantial, with around 60 personnel stationed aboard the Ludwigshafen am Rhein and another 40 personnel at the UN headquarters in Nakura. Following these recent attacks, the Bundeswehr is evaluating a heightened threat level for its forces in the region. The incident also highlights the broader defense context in which it occurs. In recent years, Israel and Germany have strengthened their military cooperation, particularly in the areas of missile defense and joint exercises. One of the most significant developments is Germany's acquisition of the Arrow 3 missile defense system, a deal valued at $3.5 billion. This marks the largest defense agreement in Israel's history, with Germany becoming the first foreign nation to procure this advanced system. The Arrow 3, designed to intercept long-range ballistic missiles, will be a key element of Germany's national defense strategy. It is also set to play a central role in NATO's broader European Sky Shield initiative, aimed at enhancing missile defense capabilities across the continent. Beyond missile defense, the defense relationship between the two countries extends to joint air exercises and the sale of advanced Israeli defense technologies, such as the Trophy Active Protection System for German tanks. These collaborations underline the strategic depth of the partnership, especially in light of shared security concerns in the Middle East and Europe. However, the relationship is not without its challenges. Germany's arms export policies have faced scrutiny, particularly regarding sales to conflict zones like the Middle East. Despite this, Germany's strategic stance prioritizes Israel's security, reflected in the official reason of state policy, which emphasizes the importance of supporting Israel's defense needs. The interception of the drone near the Lebanese coast is a reminder of the complexities and dangers faced by peacekeepers in volatile regions. As tensions continue to rise between Hezbollah and Israeli forces, and with increasing use of unmanned aerial systems, UNIFIL forces are on heightened alert. Germany's role in supporting the mission, while maintaining strong defense ties with Israel, underscores the multifaceted nature of modern military alliances and peacekeeping operations.